Hi, and welcome back to Let's Win XCOM Long War. I'm Foi. And let's look at what's coming up. We've got satellites in Canada, mag pistols, a request from Africa. Let's look at that since I've forgotten exactly what it was. Cyberdisc Rex, of which I have a lot more now than I did before, and I seem to be seeing a lot of them. Uh, I also have a lot of expensive projects finishing up, so I'm going to go ahead and dispatch the items as the Rex aren't doing anything for me now. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. Um, I wanted to look at the foundry. Uh, yeah, improved arc thrower. I'm gonna be needing some captures. Um, two weeks to finish. Maybe by the time my, by that time my tyrant armor will be out. And maybe it'll be easier to consider capturing a heavy floater or a commander. Uh. So, where are we now? Let's see. Yep, a lot of expensive things coming out. The three engineers should give me decent returns on at least the Titan armor, the Nexus, the generator. Um, probably not the satellites. Um, and how many rookies do I have? Okay. A couple okay rookies. I don't have the cash. Let's look at the gray market. I want more chitin plating. I guess I need another fear mission, terror mission, of course. Seven sectoid commander corpses. I wonder if they're good for anything. I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> Muton corpses. Need 12 more for research. Drone wrecks. Uh, uh, uh. Well. Oh, hangar. Was I gonna put a Phoenix cannon on someone? Yeah. Totally spaced on that. And... Now I've got satellites up everywhere except for Asia. I'm gonna have pretty much full world coverage. One, two, three, yeah. Except for Japan, India, and Australia, which are lost. And potentially could be regained, assuming that works correctly, <laughs> in my installation of Long War. Um, yeah, so that last satellite nexus is gonna, it's gonna do it for us, I believe. Let's look at, it. it's gonna provide one, two, Three. Okay, that should be it. So let's see what's up. No rebate. That was a foundry project. Okay, very large UFO. We're gonna touch it. It's got an unknown mission. We have eyes on the bandits. No joy here. Definitely a battleship. UFO 51. Oh my god, of course it's over in the United States. Look at it just hovering there. Like a jerk. Oh! Yeah, I wonder what it was. Ah, oh, I'm glad I asked for a terror mission. Okay, so. Let's tackle this puppy. <clears throat> All right, we've got three colonels. I definitely need my rocketeer. I need more rocketeers since they seem to get wounded or gravely wounded. And my gunners, uh, I need to fix the gunners perks. Definitely taking these two. Snipers are good. <clears throat> Want. Yeah, 
Yep. Yep. Good, good. That medic. Smoke grenade, field medic, savior. Hollow targeting, extra conditioning, tactical sense, field medic. That should be the healing I need. I want. I want a lead. Targeting bullet swarm heat ammo. Can't hurt if there's cyber discs. We have a scope and a grenade. Scopes for all. No extra conditioning on this troop. <coughs> Let's try. Hmm. Try something interesting on this character. Um, the idea being, she can really tank some chrysalid attacks with reduced damage from melee attacks and reduced damage by 50%. Plus, it gives her extra mobility. Um, and she's got the close and personal and bullet swarm and run and gun, so. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully I won't have to, like, you know... ...really send her out into the dark like that. Mags, Chitin, Scope, Scope. scope. Instead, we'll go with arc thrower. No, we're totally going to scope. Might have to reassess here.
I would put a scope on this guy. Get his name right. thinking. I want... I want a scout. Running gun, tactical sense, lightning reflexes, covering fire, rifle suppression, deep pockets. Covering Just to be sure, let's switch these positions as I know only two alien grenades can be taken. I'm not sure if it's something to do with the third item slot. I want a scope for this guy. A lot of that gerrymandering was for the scope. some med kits and we're gonna replace this with a smoke grenade all right everyone's got shiny stuff let's do this site for this operation will be in Canada. Hmm. <coughs> this can be a tough level. Wow, that perspective made the Skyranger look gargantuan compared to that building. Yeah, angry face guys, angry faces. Hostile targets. Watch your fire out there. We have civilians on the ground. Repeat, civilians are in the AO.
Look at this crazy burning bush up here. Heavy cover there. All right, assess the situation. Inside this he, this wide open building is where the worst fighting can happen. Um, it's usually possible to go through this back door and fight some in there. I think I've done this mission, this map, like twice already. Going through the front, it's very hard. These these two cars, three, uh, generally are where you end up, and you can trigger lots of squads all at once. What I think I will try and do, and remember I have zip lines so I can get to the top, but that's that's kind of exposed. It can be really dangerous. Um, what I'm gonna do, I think, is hold position out here, try not to get lured in to fight too many. Um, maybe civilians will lure some out the front. While I work some close combat specialist in through here and around the side or over the top, depending on how things look after the first turn. The first thing I'm gonna do... is we'll take our scout where here she really needs heavy cover where do I'll well, save the scout because she's got explosives Her. Oops, my lead should have got some chitin plating up in this biznatch. That's troublesome. Okay, Scout will go here first. We'll move him up here. Rockets, best used over here. Sniper? I don't know. It's almost best to just hide him really far in the back. But of course there's always that off chance that you just get murdered. Here is one of those close combat specialist types I was talking about. We're gonna dash him up here, feeling fairly confident with our scout having peaked. Our lead will want him where he can range on people. It's a shame he's got so few hit points. Our medic. This is the most likely place. He's got to move and shoot. <clears throat> He's going to be really resilient, actually. Rocketeer. I'm here. Hopefully that's out of grenade range of Zhang. Sniper. I'm gonna move him back here. Feels a little risky, I've never tried this before, but I somehow doubt I think it'll be fine. And our dervish is someone we definitely want up close and personal. Assuming no one pops out on the left up here.
I'm no longer using plasma pistols. Uh, plasma rifle overwatch. I can't afford to waste the fire um, when the alien pods haven't activated because they're just too hard to hit and there's only so few shots in the plasma rifle that I'm only going to use overwatch with carbines. Now I think about it, the aliens will not be able to get through that door, I don't think. Okay, thin men. So this might hit. Nice. What's making that noise? So he can see one. Go ahead and make an impression. Look who's here. As I need line of sight for these characters to do anything. Sniper should be able to take care of that. Let's get our dervish up here. Our smoke. Combat stem. I definitely heard a cyber disc. Come on guys, nobody? Nobody's gonna save the civilian? Let's go ahead and use the combat stim, because it's fairly certain that the next round is gonna be one of the worst. Consider moving him. He's going to take that shot. Zhang is going to move up, draw some fire, take some shots. Or not. <laughs> He'll be ready to deal the damage next action. Stupid unactivated pod dodge bonus. Ugh, stupid cyber disc. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. 
That wasn't even close. Is that all my over? Well, whatever. Jesus, Cyberdisc, for real. Okay. Got some serious movement. There's that muton. Even being suppressed. Zhang can probably make his shots count. It's an outsider. This thing's gonna be trouble. I feel like I need to drop a rocket everywhere at once. You could make a run for it. His choices are not great. Need this guy, I'm pretty sure. Probably move where she is once she moves. I need all my attacks from him. I don't have a good way to unsuppress. Maybe that muton. Nope. Might be best to just move. Take a double shot on this commander. Work out the cyber disk. Uh. 
Oh, he's got heat ammo. However, I haven't seen that do very well. Uh, we'll see. No, you can't miss. <clears throat> okay. He ammo does pretty good. Take that shot. No way. Wait. This guy. No good choices. We'll have to take this Overwatch. Uh, they missed the mark. This guy could be less lucky, but I guess he can heal himself. Being next to the exploding cyber disk probably also a bad call. I wonder if the cyber disk explosion will also cause HG cyber disk. Need that rocket. Need that dead. Scout. Probably in that with a grenade. Let's hope he kills both of those. Fire in the hole. Hope that car doesn't explode immediately. This guy, well, we just need rockets all up in their business. Is 
the answer. Nice, we all got shredded. Come on, show me. This guy's hollow targeting. Hopefully, we can kill this thing. Okay, that was as hoped. This thing has grenades. Let's just ensure that head the headshot takes it out. I'm glad I positioned him out here with no cover. This is who we should be shooting at. It's a shame. No! Jeez. These missions, these missions, so brutal. Well, at least Cyberdists are dumb. Too bad they are brutally powerful. Oh, oh no, really? I didn't even see that guy there. Sectoid commander, just skip your turn. Can I get some help? Uh, does it ever fail? Yes, it failed. <laughs> Oh my god, so good. Oh, she's... He probably used Mind Fray because she had such high willpower, because I feel like Mind Fray is more likely to work because of the combat stims. So that's kind of awesome. Well, what do you know? Things are looking not that much worse. This guy it just has some cyber disc love. I don't know how else to say it, but they really dig him in the worst way possible. And any way that cyber disc dig you is, is pretty bad. Okay, shred this cyber disc. Heat ammo. This guy has no shots left, so heat ammo is not a not gun. Not it's a deal breaker. This bra can't move for some reason. Which is pretty unfortunate. Try making the cyber disc run away. No? Well, it doesn't seem like that works anymore. <laughs>
Got some serious reloading to do. This character is still combat stemmed. She's just gonna have to tank it. And by tank I mean like pretty much everything. All the bad attention. Seriously, can't see anything behind you? Hmm. Oh, that's right, I gave him extra ammo. Wow, thank goodness. Can I waste shots on this drone? The answer is no. Okay. Well, this poor dude's gonna have to soak up. The cyber disc. Really need to reload.
So brutal. Can't afford for these shots to miss. <clears throat> Things left at three. Oh, come on, dude. Five damage, death explosion. Back online. Just gotta reload with these guys or I won't have any plasma. hit are not great. We'll reload with her. Her main job is to soak up punishment, scare things. See what this ass hat is up to. Fine. Fine. Could be a lot worse. <laughs> you jerk. Civilians! I wish civilians could be a little more... A little less useless. Obviously, not many civilians are gonna make it. Ugh, sectoid commanders in pairs, so rough. I hope I have a good rocket shot. I get like a heart attack every time it does the slow-mo for an alien. I mean the glam cam. Okay, you can't be missing this one, buddy. Please, 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 fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Okay, did that one not get hit? Got like shredded but not damaged.
I need this one dead. Okay, she reloaded. Destructible cover. Our best marksman can only get in pistol shots. She might get a crit, or she can get a crit, but it might cost her her life. Should I suppress my own unit? Her defense is super high. She's got tactical sense, so... She weren't suppressed. Come on, come on. Oh. God, life sucks. Probably just suppress my scout, although she has lightning reflexes, so that won't do me any good. Well, I could try and take this guy out. grenade Coin flip. What 
shot that's what I have left. Nothing great. Combat's dimmed. Alright, well this is gonna be ugly. Incoming fire. Not the suppression, the exposedness. Thank you, done. tactical. Yes! Oh, yes! Wow! Wow. Unbelievable. For the win. I mean... That's why she has close and personal and tactical sense and low profile and running gun. So she can run up there and make those nasty close range, super exposed calls. Um, that still, you know, it was 85, uh, very close, Reloading my weapon. very close. Guys in the back. And he's got rapid reaction. If he hits... <sighs> Rapid Reaction has yet to hit for me, I, I swear. It's like 80% misses. It doesn't have yet to hit. I've seen it hit. Still. I, I'm about to just skip that thing in general. How much damage was that? Stay alive! Oh no! Please, tactical senses. I need you alive. That's one alien I can't see. At least. Sweet. This guy isn't gonna be flanking. Let's miss. One health. Jesus. Her. 
Not seeing a whole lot of options here. Scout can certainly. Something. <clears throat> this guy is tough. Be an overwatch from that outsider back there. So here's what we'll do we'll suppress him, we'll sprint our faithful dervish. the medic. heat on this guy, maybe we can destroy his cover. Still up. Hmm. Go with Overwatch. Think anyone's impressed? Bra. Scout would be great for picking this guy off. Let's see if we can do that without using our running gun. Oh, hey, drone. This is not the enemy I'm looking for. Grenades are no good. So not into grenades. Save our rapid fire. Something like this. Hmm. Hmm. Outsider, you jerk. Yeah, run, drone. Run. Wow, well played.
Come on. Whoa, 10 damage. Those things must still be shredded. Okay. Do I have a grenade I could use? This guy desperately needs a reload. He's got Executioner. No more efficient way to use his turn than this. Reload. Get her back up to full health. Oh, man, she tanked it. One health left, jeez. Okay, this character is going to advance. Let's go ahead and. Why scouts and grenades? Anyone else got an action? Oh, she does. Headshot. Boom. Well played. Alright, so that was... Obviously that turned out really well. Whew. Whew. Mission. Missions, jeez. Advance our lead. Scouts turn. We'll move here, see if we can see whatever it is. Then we'll move here. An eyeball on it? Okay. Where's the sniper? Hold them. No dice? Is he flanked? No. That's 
not poison down there. She's already been seriously injured. There's no way, there's no amount of damage except for putting her completely down. Could cause her to spend any extra time in the hospital. So. No point in holding back. She could probably tank. Yeah, she can definitely tank another hit or two. Go down to like... Yeah, anything that doesn't reduce her below one health will be fine. Reload before healing. This guy, well, I have no idea where he is. Let me move here. Steady my weapon. <clears throat> Operator sniper, pretty useful here. Oh. Oh, wow, he had to reload? Thank goodness. Oh, really? Really, how does that work? Guy. who are a little bit extra XP with the heal. Try the shot first. Fifty chance. All right, definitely should be able to finish him off. Don't want to use a kernel to kill him if possible. Guess it's gonna be him. We need to capture one of these strange aliens. We already know that killing them won't provide anything of 16 history. civilians lost. Two saved. By the numbers. Sorry, Montreal. I did what I could. Whew. Yeah, these missions pushing me to the limit. Gravely wounded, 33 days, at least there's no willpower loss. Everyone else, not so much. Operator went up to colonel level. Sector commander, floater, cyber disk, drone, lyrium, ally. Ooh. Remember, we <sighs> are watching. Ugh, guys. All right, well, no major, um, Revelations after that. Let's, uh, ah, and no chitin plating. Let's see what pops up next. Large abductor. We're not gonna mess with it. Bangs out. But I can guess that the next mission will be an abduction. Disengaging. Yeah. 
Okay, not swarming, one panic, maybe I'll send a rookie. Alright. Thanks for watching. Looks like an abduction is going to be next, and we crawl a little bit closer to Titan armor. And of course, we rack up another month long casualty. Our um, courageous Captain Lori Martz, the dervish, really pulled through for us with a, uh, a fantastic crit on the Sectoid Commander to free her teammate and then tanking two plasma hits taking her down to one health thank you chitin plating thank you captain i will see you next game thanks for watching